soon. This will all be buried. Good riddance. Let me tell you what. I probably have abused uh, this tractor that I'm borrowing from Millennial Farmer. Yeah, I've been using it for a whole lot of dirt work. There is a lot of leveling I still need to do over here. Oh, I gotta break off this chimney. Oh man, that satellite dish made it all the way till now. Alright, let's break this stuff off. Alright, you want to talk about a lot of work? There is a lot of trees I want to cut down, so I'm sure we are going to plant some more trees around here. Uh, but I just don't want them to limit our farm. I'm not positive am I, if I'm going to leave this row of trees right here or not yet. Don't know. It, it might put a damper on my uh, farm expansion, so I don't know. We're going to see if we can live with this row of trees here. If not, we're going to cut them down. Got our supplies. Now we just need to uh, build up our new farm. Oh, I'm going by Zach's place here. The Johnson's farm. Or the Millennial Farmers. The legend. Oh, wow. What? man he gets to take out his boat and play and i am got to do some work you guys have all been on my case you know steve-o build the farm build the farm and you know what i got my supplies we're gonna build this old girl I have no idea how it's gonna turn out hopefully it's how i want it to but uh i'm gonna have to get a a lot of loads of supplies here. I just barely have the tip of the spear of what I need. But let's get up in that old cloud rope there and start building. I was lost without any direction Had a line so many times But I needed attention No matter what I say No matter my regrets Things still been said and done mm -hmm. There's not a part of me That wants to say no mm -hmm. But I have realized I had to let Something's broken And I'm the reason It's not that easy Knowing you'll do better without me Without me Without me mm -hmm. I have tried, oh I have tried, yeah To become better But I'll die again if I said it It'll last forever I know I make mistakes It's just the way I am That's why you have to know Yeah There's not a part of me that wants to say no mm -hmm. But I have realized I had to let go oh, oh. Cause something's broken
photograph of us without cares and worn out clothes doesn't seem so long ago now i'm just sitting here bored at home and it really got me thinking of the times we took off on the road So I got about, let's see, I got three hours into this. And man, as you probably noticed, I did a lot of changing around. I wanted to set it up all perfect. I don't know for sure what I'm going to do with this spot in the middle here. This is tough, tough. You guys, I always get asked, how do you build a farmyard? And basically, it's a lot of time. That's simple. Simple how it is. It's just a lot of time and effort goes into this type of stuff no simple way about it but ooh, man I kind of like the way it looks I I usually don't like this modern of a farmyard but I'm gonna I'm gonna go with it I I mean why wouldn't you use this house if you could just uh, build it yourself of course you want to live in that house I kind of want to leave the farmyard over in the distance kind of for a reason I kind of like it the way it feels and everything. I'm hoping it all turns out and it keeps going. Right now it feels like it was designed this way. I'm hoping. Hopefully it feels that way. You guys will have to let me know what you like and don't like. I mean, it's really pretty much permanent by the time you guys see it. But I'm hoping to do it. I'm not for sure what I'm going to do here in the center. I'm thinking some type of a flag monument but we'll work on that it's funny how times roll by mm. is it 12 years since last time where'd you go what's the score did you find what you were
done finally uh let's see i got about six hours on here i still got more to do i got a hovering piece of wood here still got a lot more to do as you can tell uh i'm gonna use this as my project garage just kind of like uh zach does zach johnson I, I think i'm gonna put a few toys in there i'm gonna i have a few containers as you could see around here most of them are for the cattle I am going to try to get into cattle onto this farm. You know, I, I, I know Zach, he isn't much into the livestock. I did end up putting in a new little place here in the center. I kind of just like it. It was too big an area. I had to do something with it. Don't know. I might change it up a little bit. I'm not done with this place just yet. I do like how the bins are set up. Yep gonna have to do a little bit more work with that man leveling and getting everything just so it looks almost like it was designed to be there takes a lot of time trust me a whole lot of time I I do have my uh, cold storage right here 
And this is going to be where I shove up all my projects or old uh, equipment, you know, waiting to be fixed up or just uh, rusting out like the old truck there. Uh, so I do have a horse barn right here. Uh, I guess that door don't open. Still don't open. Alright, so we got... <laughs> The horse barn here, similar to like we had in uh, Nebraska land, if you can remember that. Kind of similar. Not as giant as that one, but I think I kind of just love the looks of it, for to be honest. And two, I mean, let's get some horses over here. Why not? Raise some horses, fatten them up. Uh, I got a little, uh, a couple cow pins here, cattle pins got the old I don't know if I'm gonna just have I even got a squeeze chute right here for vaccinations and branding and loading chute I don't know if I'm going to use this as a dairy or just uh, fattening the cattle I guess uh, I am playing with seasons so you don't really get a lot out of dairy kettles on seasons unless you play a lot of seasons season long like year long uh, I kind of like this setup. Uh, I think this is Elk, Mo yeah, Elk Mountain Ranch modding here. Uh, pretty good setup. The house is also uh, Elk Mountain modding. So uh, the buildings are similar to Zach Johnson's, or is actually the same. Actually, I did try to use different buildings. I don't know it just wasn't looking right the the color the texture has to be just right I didn't want to look like all the buildings Mitch match and I wanted to use the horse barn and the old rusty uh, Elk Mountain uh, ranch there so had to use some different things I was going to use a different uh, house but man this house is almost too perfect can't really get away from that house it's perfect I get it a lot of people use it but there's a reason for it it's almost a perfect house if you want to be realistic let me tell you if I was building a farm and had an unlimited amount of wallet space I would build that house love the rancher style houses we got to get some equipment you see we don't really have we got some equipment don't have a lot of equipment Got to add some stuff here. But thank you all for watching. And I will see you later over here in Millennial Farmer Style. Thank you all for watching. Like, comment, and share and subscribe.